Alex got the big ones. Just the essentials here. <laughs> got our masks ready. Gonna be wearing them for the next very, very long time. are in Prague. It was a long night of traveling, but we made it here and checked into our hotel and I just showered and got all ready. And now we're gonna quick go grab a snack and a latte before we have a walking tour tonight that's about like an hour, just to kind of learn our way around and see more of Prague. So I will take you guys along with us on the walking tour. And then when I get back, or at some point, I'll give you a whole tour of our hotel room, but it's kind of a disaster right now because we just like threw everything down, but just wanted to say, hi, we're here, we made it. The flight was just a whole situation. I like get so sick on flights and this one, yeah. Not the best for me, but here we are. And I'm excited. It's a little chilly out. Um, it's like 55, which at home when we left, it was like 75. So luckily I brought jackets and stuff. I'm just wearing this shirt jacket with a black turtleneck sweater, jeans, and then these little booties. It's my outfit for the night. Almond milk latte, matcha latte. A latte slabs. <laughs> First meal of Prague. It actually looks so good. Here's your potatoes. First impressions of Prague. It's cool. So pretty. Should I tell us about our fun fact about Czechoslovakia? <laughs> we just learned from our tour guide that apparently Czechoslovakia is the Czech Republic and Slovakia split apart in 1993. 19... Not that long ago. We thought Czechoslovakia was a whole other country. So, more you know. <laughs> That's why we're on the tour. Latte number two of the day. Alec thought they wouldn't have any oat milk or almond milk, and turns out I had an almond milk and now I have oat milk, so they do. We're safe. started at 10 a.m. which is very early for breakfast so you don't usually eat until like 11 but we just went to the first place and had coffees and they gave everyone eggs benedict first time having that <laughs> and i ate the eggs and they were good we didn't put them together <laughs> kristen do you want to give your thoughts how was your eggs benedict so good <laughs> our tour guide said the first place there's the best coffee second place hot chocolate third place was tea and fourth place was beer so okay a second house is uh, one of the one of the It's good without it too.
walking back from our food tour. Stuffed ish. I didn't even vlog at the last place. I vlogged walking in, but I didn't vlog any of the food because it was scary. <laughs> Chicken pate. Chicken pate, some fish cake. I don't know. Like the tours, sometimes you get really good food, and then usually you get a lot of traditional food, which for someone that doesn't eat gluten or dairy or meat didn't go well for me. So I guess I'm actually not that full, but I had like eggs at the first place. So we're fine, like three coffees. I was trying to pour water and my hand was like shaking because I've had so much coffee. Are you full? Yeah. And got a lot of stuff in my stomach. We've got like a mixture in our stomach because we took like a bitter shot at one place. Was that like the third place? So it's just a mixture going on, but I think we're gonna do some shopping. We're going back to the hotel now and then might do some shopping around. We have a bar tour tonight after dinner. So yeah, just exploring for the day. Yeah. <laughs> and I really wanna go to Mango and the Zara here looks nice too. Although my bag was already 53 pounds on the way here. So it was a little scary. I did in the middle of the airport take stuff out and put it in Alex's bag. Love that for me. They never made us do that. I know. It was really surprising that they cared because I feel like usually they don't care about extra weight, but never. And then they my did. parents were right behind us. And then, yeah, over. his parents' bags were over and they didn't care. So something about us or me. You had an attitude. I did not. I was so nice to her because we were gonna ask about upgrading our seats. But anyways, that's the tea. It's been a good day so far. Alec is happier today. He was really grumpy yesterday. <laughs> I was not. You were. And it's not too cold out. I thought it was going to be freezing today, but I mean, I have literally a huge sweater and jean jacket and leggings on, but it's, it's so warmed nice. up. It's nice and warm. Oh, that's where you want to get me a ring from? <laughs> okay, I'm going to give you a full room tour. Alec is currently in the bathroom so i'll show you that in a minute but when you walk in there is just this closet here and then another big closet with this is the only like full length mirror and in here hung up a bunch of clothes and my shoes are also in there this door goes actually to kristen's room so they're kind of connected and then pretty straightforward bed tv lots of water we stopped at a little supermarket and got a ton of water because i feel like in Europe, we never drink enough water. And then all of my clothes are sitting here. Chair. This is the view, the most important part, which Alec was insistent on leaving the blinds open last night. And then at like 4 a.m., we woke up and shut them because I could not sleep. And then Alec's kind of mess over here, all of his clothes, desk, some snacks, bags, sunglasses. That's about it. Oh, the bathroom. Here's the bathroom. Got a nice zoomed in mirror here and shower. So there's the room tour. This is the Hilton Prague Old Town. I know there's a couple different Hiltons in Prague, but this is in the Old Town and it is a super good location, really central. Everything has been really quick walks, which is nice. It's a walkable city, as we've been saying, because sometimes, like when we were in Paris, we had to take like transportation everywhere, but it's super nice that we can walk literally everywhere here. <laughs> I think I'm funny. Spritz time. What is that? Whiskey sour? <laughs> oh, you want to be in it? I'm struggling so much. I can't decide. Who are you calling? You're going to stop it. Let's be more mature than that. We are about to head to dinner and the bar tour. I thought I would show you guys my outfit. I am wearing this black Abercrombie dress over this other black Abercrombie dress. I think I'm going to wear it tied. I might end up untying it with some tights and boots. And then I'm bringing like my super small purse here. You can see better in this mirror. Um, just my like wallet on chain. So I don't have room to bring my camera. So I will try to vlog on my phone, but we'll see how the night goes. We're headed out. It would be fun. Ready? Yeah. Cheers. <laughs> Good 
Good morning. It is Tuesday now and we just ate a little breakfast at the hotel. And now we're gonna go get some coffees because they did not have any like almond milk or oat milk or any dairy free milks at the hotel breakfast. So we're gonna go to a cafe and get some coffee. Like where are they laying right behind me? And then I think we're gonna do some more shopping. We have a bike tour today which I have had literally anxiety about for the last like 24 hours because biking is just not my specialty. I have not biked in years and it's like really busy and I don't know, I'm just hoping we're not gonna be biking like right down the middle of the like city center because yeah, hopefully it's like off the trail where there's not a ton of things I can hit. Before then, we're gonna go shopping. I was struggling so much yesterday when we were shopping because I couldn't decide. I didn't want to make like an impulse purchase. So I think I know what I'm gonna do now. So I'm excited to go back. Yesterday I didn't have my passport either and in order to like buy expensive bags here, you have to have your passport for like the tax exemption, I think, thing. So <coughs> that's the agenda for today. Oh, and the outfit of the day. I'm wearing a just a black turtleneck tucked in. O O T D with my big leather puffer and my golden geese. At this point, no shoes are comfortable and I just don't want to wear shoes. Okay. Thank you for carrying it. <laughs> I caved. Here it is, ginormous bag, and so much in here. I got it, and you can't like vlog in there, but I just got back to the room, and now we are getting ready to go on our bike tour. Never been so excited for anything in my life. Are you bringing glasses? In case I get any bugs in my eye. It'll be okay. Adventure. <laughs> I liked the shopping part of the day. All right, I'm not gonna bring a bag. Ready? Go bike. Wednesday morning, it's like 8.30. We are getting all packed up, sad, sad. We just went and had the a little hotel breakfast and it was actually better today because we figured out that you could order stuff from like the chef so you could like get eggs instead of having the like buffet eggs. <laughs> so it was pretty good. We definitely need coffee though. So we might go grab like a cappuccino or latte quick since we have a little bit of time before our car is getting here. And then we are taking a car to the train station and then the train will take us to Vienna, which is like a three to four hour train ride. And we're honestly excited for the train ride because we've done so much walking. Excited to sit in the car for half a day and then get to Vienna. So that is the end of this vlog, the first travel vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss my Vienna travel vlog, which will be coming very soon. I'm so excited for Vienna and to explore there. I'll see you in the next one.